Hi, this is Madeline from Sonic Bloom with a new episode in a tutorial series called With a Little Help from Max for Life. And in this fifth tutorial, we're gonna take different parts from what we've previously created and put them together. And especially I want to show you how you can use the multi-map that we used in the second part to also control anything that generates melodies to be in key. And for this, I've added the Dr. Chaos melodies that we created in the first episode, the vibraphon part, and I turned off the clip, deactivated it. I also deactivated the clip for the bass track. And I have added the MIDI effect rack that we had created with the rotating rhythm generator in the previous tutorial. And so now we're going to make sure that they are always in key. And I can just play that now. And they're both in A major and actually fits with everything. So that basically fits, but you know, we might want to jam um, other things as well. So um, we're going to need the Max for Life Essentials pack again for the multi pack. So on the packs, Max for Life Essentials, and then under control devices, we're going to grab another multi map, add it to the master because we're going to map things from two different tracks. And I'm going to click on map here. And then I can click on root note that will set it to C. And we're going to go back to the master, click on map again, go to the bass track and map it to transpose. But now we have to go here and have to, make, have to make sure that it's also set to C so that it works the same way. And then going back to the master, add another multi map, click on map, go back to the vibraphone part, and then we can map the scale. And going back to the master, click on map, and we're just going to choose major minor for the bass track. But here in the vibraphone part, when I unfold this, right now it's set to major, but if I'm turning this to 127%, and I go back to the bass, nope, to the vibraphone part, it's now set to chromatic, so we're gonna have to make sure that it's it fits, so we're going to have to set that to something small. See, 3% maybe. Yep, now it's set to minor, so now we can play it and it works. Well, not exactly with the vocals. And... We can, of course, also map these to our one knob control center. Well, that's it. Hope you found this helpful. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.